Eric Miller from Neurocom International in Portland, and this is the Smart Equitest. This is a system that's used for assessment and treatment for balance disorders. And what happens in this environment is it allows us to isolate different sensory inputs to balance. What happens in the patient's case is they're in a reactive environment. Uh, as the patient sways, the, the either the, the the uh, visual surround, the walls around him, or the support surface that he's standing on, or both, will sway in response to his sway. It gives us a chance to get some insight as to what information the patient's using to control their posture, and uh, if we make that information or that information inaccurate, it gives us some insight as to. Uh, whether they can recognize the channel as being inaccurate, switch strategies to a different system. This is condition six of the sensory organization test. It means that we're set up for sway referenced uh, visual surround as well as sway referenced platform. And what's happening is that if the patient sways, the, the environment he's in will react to that. It makes it very difficult for them to rely on, the, on surface information or visual information. So in order for him to maintain his posture, he has to use vestibular cues. It's a vestibular demand task. It allows us to, to get some assessment as to how well he uses vestibular information to control his posture.